There's an organization in Manhattan that's uh, called the Robin Hood Organization, and uh, they had a big benefit, and they invited me there, and also Lady Gaga was uh, gave a full show to them, and uh, so my son suggested that I, I meet her, and after the show was over, I. I walked over to her, and she was with her mother and father and her boyfriend at the time. And uh, I said to her, I'd love to make a record with you. And she said something so wonderful. She looked at me right smack in the center of my eyes, and she said, whatever you want to do, I'm going to do it with you. And what I like about her is that she kept her word. Uh, she not only uh, was happy about doing the album, uh, making the, the lady is a tramp, you know, and, and, and what I love is almost everybody I meet, they just love the whole album and they, they just, they're crazy about uh, how she sang this great standard, a Rogers and Hart standard, and uh, everybody said, I had no idea that she sang that great. That's how, that's what happened with that record. So, uh, and, uh, you know, and, and then when I saw her perform that night, I couldn't believe the audience reaction. She's going to be a standard for many, many years, and she's quite different. She's different almost every night. She changes into something at all times. She becomes a, another artist, and she's very, very. When I saw the MTV Awards, she she won the award that night, and but she she played a man. And I, I, I told her, I said it. I said, if this was in a film, you would have gotten the Academy Award for what you did. She's, you know, and she was smoking a cigarette, and she said, by the way, I don't smoke. So she was just acting that she is <laughs> smoking a cigarette. But she's quite clever and, uh, and deep. I, I think if people just allow her to be herself uh, throughout her career, I think she's going to be like America's Picasso. She's very, very creative and very uh, contemporary at all times.